Welcome to Play Digital Signage Tutorials. In this tutorial, we take a closer look at slide conditions. Slide conditions are conditions you can add to one or more slides that tell your player when to play the slide. For example, you may have a slide that you want to play only on Mondays and only between noon and 1 p.m. Let's go to playlists and open a playlist. Now let's open the settings for slide number one. If we scroll a bit down, we find slide conditions. Let's open that. Here you see four different types of slide conditions, date and time, time range, weekday, and screen. Let's explore each of the types. The first one is the date and time range. Let's set the start date to this coming Monday, the end date to Tuesday, and click add. As you see, we've added a condition that means this slide will only play between March 27th and March 28th, meaning this slide would not be playing today. Let's remove this condition and check out the next. The second type is time range. Time range means you can tell the player to run a slide within a predefined time of day. We can set the start time to noon, the end time to 1 p.m., and then click add. Now, this slide will play every day of the week between noon and 1 p.m. The third type is weekday. The weekday condition is naturally the day of the week. You can choose, for example, Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday, and then click Add. This slide is now playing only on Mondays, Tuesdays, and Wednesdays. Also, keep in mind you can mix slide conditions. You could add a slide condition where a slide is playing only on Mondays, and then another slide condition where a slide is playing only between 9 a.m. and 10 a.m. The last type is Screen. The Screen Slide condition lets you play specific slides on specific screens. For example, if you have a playlist that is published on 25 screens, but in different locations, you might have local content that should only play on some of your screens. You simply find your screen or screens and then click Add, and then the slide is only playing on the chosen screens. Keep in mind, when you've added your slide conditions, you need to click Save. Going back to the playlist, we see that slide number one has a dotted line around it. This means the slide has one or more slide conditions. We also see a dot indicating this slide is currently active and playing. If we go back to slide settings, remove the current slide setting, and then add a date and time condition, where this slide only plays March 27th and March 28th. Click add and then save. You'll see that the dotted line is there and that the dot is indicating this slide is not playing. Thanks for listening. I hope this was helpful and I'll see you at the next one.